Hi guys, and today I'm going to be fixing up my doll's Caroline's hair. She has very curly hair, and I uh, she was one of my first dolls, and I uh, I did not know really how to take care of it. So now I'm going to try and fix it all up. As you can see, it's very matted and knotted. So I'm going to put her in a seat. This is, makes it easier for me to brush her. You can also get put her between your knees or if you have a salon chair. I do have one but it leans back a lot so I'm going to be using this chair. Also if you have a doll with curly hair and you do want to follow along feel free. I'm going to be telling you step by step on how to do it. So for it you will need a brush with wild bristles. I got this from American Girl but you can get this from any beauty store. You can use a, you can also use like a pick. I got this from American Girl Doll Store. They recommend this, but I don't think, th I think a brush is easier to use and does better with the hair. I'm going to be using bobby pins to hold the hair in place, but you can also use clips, bows, and curlers. Now you will need a spray bottle. You can use a doll spray bottle. They are very cheap. And, or you can find just a normal cleaning spray bottle that works just the same. You'll also need something to wrap the hair around. You can use the end of a brush, but this was close near me, and I figured out that this works very well. So if you have this, you can use this. Okay, now I'm going to start brushing Caroline's hair. And before I do that, I have already done some curls. So I'm going to move those out of the way and then I'm going to take a little section of her hair and start brushing it out. Now this was one of my first dolls so her hair is very naughty. I, I left it in a ponytail for a very very long time like three years maybe but I did not I was very scared to take it out of the pony but the next step is spritzing her hair with water. Now, you need to do this if her hair is knotty or not. This also, the water helps keep the curls in. Now, brushing her hair did take me a little bit longer than I would normally do if you do this regularly. Because, as I said, I have not brushed her hair in a super duper long time. When you're brushing your doll's hair, make sure to go from the bottom to the top, not just go from the top to the bottom because you might break the doll's hair. And the way the, the doll's hair works is when you brush from the top to the bottom, you just pull all the knots down to the bottom and then there'll be a even bigger disaster than when you started. Okay, now that you've got that section of hair all brushed out and there are no knots, you're going to get either the, your, and your bobby pin clip or whatever you have, your item to wrap around. It can even be just a pin or marker. You can even use the end of your brush to do this, but I'm going to be using my doll straightening iron, wrapping, around, wrapping the hair around it and then take sliding it off when it's still curled and then clipping a bobby pin or clip into it once it's slid off. Now you can do this and just let it go and put a little bit more water on it, but I really wanted her curls to stand out so I'm going to be doing it this way. Oh. 
Okay, now you're just going to repeat this process around the entire head. What I did was start on one side of the head and work my way around and then start on the other side of the head and then fill in pieces underneath as I went. But you can do it however you want. Now, I am going to say this did take a long time, so if you're going to do this and your girl's hair is very naughty, I would recommend either splitting the hair up and doing section one section one day and the other section another day, or doing it like I did and turn on a movie or something while you do it. Okay, this is Caroline's head all done in curlers, and I'm going to leave it in for the night, and I'm going to show you the finished product in the morning. And it has been a night, and I am going to take her hair out of these little curl things, I guess. And as you can see, once I take in, have taken them out, they look like curls. And I'm going to do that for her entire head. And her hair should look nice with nice, beautiful curls. And this is how she turned out. I'm very happy on how she turned out. Her hair is beautiful and it's brushed out now so I can do different hairstyles on her and use her beautiful hair more often. Hi guys, I'd like to say thank you guys so much. If you have watched this video 
or if you keep on coming back and watching all of my videos, that means a lot to me. And also, if you sub subscribed, that means a lot too. I have five subscribers right now. Just kidding, by the time I posted this, it was six. Right. When I'm filming this, and I am so amazed that I have five you right now. You mean six? And once, I would like to say a big announcement, once I hit... 10 subscribers we're halfway there when i'm making this so we only need five more to make it to 10 so if we make it to 10 i will get some clothes and accessories for american girl and i will do a unboxing video so basically i open it i put it on my dolls tell you how i like it and i think i'm going to get some of their newer stuff so you can decide if you want to get it or not so if you haven't subscribed and you like american girl dolls and you like this video it'd be mean so much if you subscribed and once we get to and if you've already subscribed thank you so much and once we hit 10 We'll get some stuff from Making Girl. So, let's get on with the rest of the video. Hi, this is Addie, and before you go, I'd like to say thank you so much for watching this video. Addie, I need your help! I'm filming, I'll come help you in just a second. Anyway, if you like this video, I'm sure you'll like my other videos. It's mine! No, it's mine! I hit it first! Stop! While I deal with this, I'll pass it over to my friend. Hi, and I'm going to show you how you can get to my channel and my videos. So first thing you can do is type in Addie's AG or Addie's AG Adventures. And once you've searched that, it should bring you to all of my different videos and my icon. So one way you can get to my channel is by typing, by clicking the icon and that should bring you to this page where you can see all my videos and subscribe. You can subscribe right beside my little icon. Or you can click on my video, scroll down, and click, scroll down, and you'll see an icon. You can click that. You can also subscribe there, and that's where you can find all my videos. One last thing if you like my videos and want to subscribe, that'd mean a lot. Bye!